Hello guys and welcome back. So in this last video of this section, we are going to talk about resetting the form. So let's say I had a button here, like so, and it had the text reset. Its type is just button and not submit. And it's uh, button and button warning. Let's try this class out. Save this and if I go back to the page here then I should see a reset button as well. Now let's bind an event named click to it and I should reset the I should call the reset form method when this is clicked. So now if I go back let's just specify this method in here. Um, what I can do now is call the user form method dot there is a method named reset on it if I call it then it should reset the form for me so if I go back now we already have all these fields um, filled up but if I click on reset then it should uh, basically clear out all the form for us right so this is how the form can be resetted in one go uh, and this was it regarding uh, reactive forms and the angular forms as a whole in the next video we will be talking about leveraging uh, in the next section we would be talking about leveraging um, third party libraries like uh, firebase and uh, angular material and after that we'll have a look at uh, unit testing in angular so i'll see you guys in the later sections of this training Bye.